I don't know why, but isn't there something charming about a, an early 2000s Henry? Well, that's what's before my eyes. This is pretty much what I had when I was growing up, except ours had wheel caps and slightly later style base. Oh, the phone really isn't want to focus. Oh, that looks alright. I don't know, recently I've just really liked the sort of UDS Henrys. Hopefully getting another one soon, not a push button or a rocker switch. This one I got off eBay. It cost quite a lot of money. Uh, what actually happened, I didn't intend to pay so much for it. I was putting in like, you know how on eBay you put a max bid in. Well, the last second I just literally let my fingers go crazy and I put in some random high bid. I think it was over £100 or something. Just so I thought I would win it. I didn't expect anyone to go as high as it did. However, I'm not telling you how much it went for. You'll have to search the completed items like a failure who has nothing else to do with their time. Anyway, so I got it off eBay. I was really keen on I had my heart set on getting this one because it is like hardly been used. If the lighting was good, you'd see that the wheels are mint. The tubes are all not beaten up. That looks like it's never been used. Usually they're slack as anything. And the hose is good. One of the front wheels arrived damaged, so that's why one of them is more worn than the other, but nobody would notice if I hadn't pointed it out. It's just in very good condition. Apparently it was a backup, which would make sense. But you'll see there's a slight scuff, but there's nothing there mint, if you could see them. There's no wave on them. Flexing and everything's that nice shiny way. And the floor head, the bristles. I don't know if it's just what I remember, where I was just like really mashed overhead, but these bristles are really, really good, lots of life in them. So yeah, it's a wee bit scuffed on the head, but we can live with that. I prefer a slightly used one than a brand new one, otherwise you won't want to use the brand new one. If we look inside, we have a filter, which has a wee bit of carbon on it, but it's spotless otherwise. And a couple of them smellies, which are kind of useless actually. Let's see, when is this bag from? Because I actually found a few. That's 2003 as well. I had a couple 2003 ones I found, which might have been from when my mum's Henry was new, because my mum's Henry was also 2003. I think hers was, was it week 35 or week 33 my mum's one was? This one's week 18, so it's before the wheel caps were added. But aye, it's just in very good condition. Another thing about these Henrys, they have a 12 and a half metre cable, just that extra nice touch. Because I can remember when I used to use the other one when I was wee, I could plug it in in the hallway and go right up to all the bedrooms and everything. It looks dusty and that's actually because I haven't stripped and cleaned it yet. Well, I've washed the base to get the muck off, I washed the filter, I just touched it up a bit. I haven't actually refurbed it so we've seen it pretty much untouched. Oh, they're just going to put a light clean up. So don't judge me that there's dust under there, but then, for the sake of this, this machine, why would you bother taking it apart and refurbishing this? I'm going to get dusty again. I checked the motor. It's in excellent shape. Pretty much no wear to it, to be honest. And it sounds nice and healthy too. sound pretty much. So yeah, they're good. I like these Henry's, despite the motors being a wee bit unreliable. Suction's good, they're quite a nice design, especially these kind of slightly older ones with the older wheels. Yeah, what's not a love? Thank you for watching again, I guess. Right, just right after filming that. I'm gonna go rake about and see if I've got any other machines to film.